Okay, so I'm gonna make a video here. I got a lot of video equipment and one thing's been bugging me. I don't have a slider for my camera. So I'm gonna try to thrift the slider here, man. I got a DJ Osmosis gimbal. It works really good with my phone, okay? I don't wanna buy one. They're $500 for the camera. I'm not buying one. A gimbal for the phone. They're really nice. They're up to 15. They're just really expensive. But I'm gonna try to make a slider for thrift, okay? I got this old tripod I bought for five bucks, six bucks. I'm gonna harvest it, okay? It's busted up here, man. Like it broke here and it's not very good here and it's sticky and it's squeaky and it's not very good. So we're gonna harvest it for parts here. I borrowed some roller wheels for my kids. They don't use them, okay? Uh, I, fuck, $3 I think I paid for that at garage sale, okay? And this is a cutting board. I'm pretty sure it's a dollar store cutting board, so two bucks. So let's say a $10 slider here. We're gonna make a $10 slider. It's already paid for, so we've already used the stuff. So this is called reusing, thrifting, whatever. I call it thrift nally, man. So we're gonna make a slider out of this camera stuff right here. We're gonna use my few few screws I got this is a bucket of random screws I got some drill bits all right and I got a black and decker toolbox I ain't even good man I don't got the good stuff but I got what I got and we do what we do so I'm gonna go outside I'm gonna harvest these parts and we'll come back in and see what we got okay so harvested the parts okay got uh, got the pieces cut down here pieces cut down here pieces cut down tripod still a little bit tripod but I needed the rails, okay? Harvested the rails here. So I just went outside, hacked that all up, took maybe 10 minutes. So I'm gonna do take two, put it all together, shut the cameras off, put it all together, and see what we come up with in about five minutes here. Okay, that's that. All right. Got her done. This is what we got. Came out pretty nice. So I had the rail slider on the rails. These are just prototype because I have to mount them to a board and I don't have time. I gotta glue this center piece in right here. You can't see it, but it's making everything a little bit loose. Has to get glued overnight and I can't do nothing about it. Once it gets glued, I can tighten the bolts fully and then this will not move at all. And then I'll be able to turn. And I gotta glue it like, put some WD-40 on that biatch. Cool. So this is my slider. This is the idea. This is the concept. Have it on the rails here to let it go. But for me, what I need it, I don't even need the rails. It was a great idea. I think they'll still do that in the future for someone else that needs it. I would not recommend one of these pieces for the slider, but it's good for the camera to get on and off and get your shit out and get, get on with your day. So we're going to set up our first slide here and we're going to just put it on see how she looks. Just keep in mind, remember I got to tighten it up, okay? So. Boom, that's on. I really wish it was tight right now, I could show you. Ready, set, go. Beauty. Beauty, son, that's a beaut, man. So that's what we're gonna use it for, okay? So I should just be able to hold this and drive it in. I don't know if you can see the image on an image, but. Maybe it'll get better. It's just because I'm going to set up for shooting in this direction, I, quite honestly. Or maybe I'll show you over here. Or maybe I'll show you over here. Zoom in on the bag. Here's a nice close up by the black and bag. Okay. That's what we're going to do, even though I don't got my lights. I think I'm going to set up right just like that. Okay. And I just got to. And that's that. That was a good one. That was a good one. I'm pumped about that one. That was a good one. So that's the camera slider, and that's uh, that's why I did it. Just for a couple shots, I'm gonna be using it a lot. I think just for a little extra features. I'm gonna do a video on my desk and all the hard work I put into that one day. So. Okay, I got the slider here. I'm pretty excited. Look how solid it is. Uh, don't mind the extra mess. I found Gavin's timer just now, two seconds ago. I looked all day for it. So, check the bar. A couple screws in the bottom here. I got my microphone here. Just move it. 
checked a couple screws here now look how easy it is i'm going to focus on the apples i'm going to take a nice pan in pan out and pan out Okay, now I did one with the DSLR. This is a dummy camera. I just show people like, you know, camera tricks and stuff. If I got to use a dummy camera and that's it. So look how easy it comes on and off, man. Just like that. Just like that. Boom. On, off, boom. Dummy camera. On, off, boom. Just like that. New camera on. Like, you know what I mean? The slider works pretty good, man. Like I got multiple cameras that'll work good for. The GoPros will go on there. The lights, it'll work for the lights, even if I gotta remove lights too, like you know, I could use the gimbal for other things. This thing is gonna work for like multiple things. Like I love it. I think this was a really good thrift for like five bucks, ten bucks. It's ten bucks at the most. I've already used the stuff. It's free, man. This was free. Free money. It was all stuff in my house. So took a tripod, cut it down, made a slider. That's what it is. Thanks for watching, stay tuned, share the video, maybe someone else is bored at home too, you never know. I had this idea before the coronavirus, but now she came to fruition. This is the behind the scenes of what I gotta shut off. I just finished shooting a set here, so I gotta shut everything off. Look, there's five things, okay? So I'm gonna shut my battery off to this, to the lapel mic, and you gotta hold it. Take a second, I gotta shut that off. Okay, I shut the camera off, okay? I shut the other mic off, okay? You gotta shut the light off, okay? Follow me. <laughs> and then I gotta shut these lights off. Usually I have the bank of lights on, but I don't have the time to fucking deal with that shit. So that's five things I gotta shut off every time I just do one little video, okay? So now I'm gonna make my thing here, okay? And then I gotta go turn those five things on and then shoot my video and then turn those five things off, right? So that's where I'm saying it's time consuming and shooting a video when I don't get any help. I can ask my girlfriend just to take this video and I get a lot of grief from it. So well, I'll show you to get ready for a video. Okay, we've got the lights. They're not working right now because I have to replace the light bulbs. I just want to make this video and I don't have time. So I grab this light and I put it here. Like I need light. So okay, come on with me. Okay, so this is the camera set up and it's got the mic set up, which you get the lapel mic. That took me 20 minutes to get that clamp on there. 20 minutes to get that clamp on there. Nobody can help me. Nobody. I got to do all this stuff. It takes forever. It takes forever. So that's why I'm just trying to <laughs> struggle making videos. Because it takes me forever. So this is the camera I just set up. I already did some few takes, right? This is my light. I got on another tripod here. And then if you come down here, let me show you this. The aftermath of a video shoot. Here's all the bits I was talking about. It's junk on the floor. Tables a mess. The desk has just stuff all over it. Floor is covered in my stuff. The couch has my stuff and Gavin's socks. So many chargers, lights, and stuff. So many tools of the trade, you know? Okay, so that's what it takes for me to get set up for this little video I'm about to shoot right here. So, Lisa, thank you very much for taking this video, and I'll see you in about half an hour. Come on, Kate. Okay, I'm gonna get this thing set up. Two. Fat heeled rollerblade heelys. They're just heelys, man. I found them at the thrift store. I don't know what I'm talking about. Oh, this is like take 10. I'm so bad. My idea is just have these long rails from the tripod. Okay, so that was, this is the slider, man. That's it. Because they're just taped. Once I do the math and screw them down, it'll be fine. So that was the rail system. Look at it. I'm just going to use that.